Hello everyone and welcome to Flicky. This is a spin-off game starring star well uh, starring the birds of the Sonic the Hedgehog franchise. These are the Flickies, ladies and gentlemen. And this has nothing really to do with Sonic games in particular, but it is a pretty fun arcade title, so I figured I may as well show it off. And uh, basically what you're going to be doing for every level now is you're going to be jumping from area to area, from place to place, avoiding all of the cats. The cats will eat the birds. You want to keep them away from the birds. And uh, basically pick up pots and whatnot on your way to throw at all of the cats and whatnot in the environment. But basically, it's an arcade game akin to the likes of Pac-Man, akin to the likes of um, Defender. Just so you have to avoid the cats instead of, like, shoot the things, you know, folks? Or dodge the ghosts. That's all there really is to it, and as you can tell, whenever you die, all of your flickies will actually stay in the same place. They will stay in, stay in the same location. So, um... Yeah, you can use that to your advantage if you get trapped. If you die, and you can, all your flickies will stay in the same area so you can pick them all up. But you'll find yourself needing to pick up items along the way, such as these hammers, such as a bunch of pots and whatnot to chuck. Otherwise, the cats will clip you, the cats will clip your flickies, and the flickies will go everywhere. And, uh, yes, this does, to a lot of people, this will remind a lot of people of Sonic 3D, because Sonic 3D was basically the same concept, just taken into a Sonic game, you know, folks, and... I like it, I like this game, it's quite fun. The music's a little bit annoying, though, just because it's really ear loud, but, uh, the extra tune is very catchy, the... Music's pretty neat, and after every couple of stages as well, we do have these sort of bonus round-ish areas where we need to collect as many flickies as possible as well. So, um, yeah, this is obviously the game where Sonic 3D Flickies Island got its original concept from, you know? And just like in Sonic 3D Flickies Island, you don't need to collect all of the flickies at once, you can take them to the exit after collecting them, which is all handy. It's very handy indeed. So, uh... Yeah. It's a pretty fun game, what can I say? It's 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 one of those arcade games that's surprisingly addictive to get into, and it does ramp up in difficulty more and more and more every time you play it, so... It, it's addictive. It's a good fun game. I, I'd recommend people to give it a shot. In fact, I didn't even know this game existed until quite a few years ago when Sonic Mega Collection first got released. Because this game is one of the uh, bonus games you can unlock in Sonic Mega Collection. And that's how I learnt that this game existed, you know, folks. I, I never knew this this was a thing until then. So, technically, yeah, the whole concept of collecting birds and taking them to an area has been done before Sonic 3D. Because even though I'm actually doing this, you know, I'm covering this game past Sonic 3D, it's actually a game that I've... Uh, it's a game that I've sort of skipped out on in the Sonic series because this game came out way back near around the time of Sonic 1. This came out back in 1991, you know, folks, so... Even though I technically should have done this game beforehand because I'm doing this game series for the most part in chronological order, you know, I saved it till the end because why not? I might as well shave, save all my sheepish look at for this until the end. Later games in the series, I'll probably just do the look at straight off when they're meant to be, because there's less games I'm going to be doing look at, so. But uh, this is all she really wrote. It's a pretty fun game, I'd recommend it, and I got really nothing to say about it. It's just a traditional collect the flickies, dodge the cats sort of deal. Although you do find yourself bouncing off walls a lot. Anyway, that is it for this, so thank you all for watching. I know it's a short one, but, uh, you know, we do not fret, folks. I got a new video coming shortly. So, thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't be sheepish, people. Now, catch you all again. Bye!